Um, I don't believe that this is a religious issue, uh, Representative Lesh. And if you look uh, in the state of Minnesota, we have lots of laws on the books that provide punishment for people that inflict pain on others. And in fact, on a federal level, it seems kind of odd, but we make sure that those that are sentenced to death are comfortable. So from my perspective around this issue, with the growing scientific evidence, and in fact, we had testimony in the health committee from a Catholic priest who was born at either 20 or 21 weeks and survived, um, example of viability at this stage, but that's not what we're discussing here. But with the growing medical uh, evidence that we are in fact subjecting these unborn children, and I apologize if you don't like that term, to the process of ripping them limb for limb and if they can feel pain as growing scientific, scientific evidence would support, I believe that there has to be a balance. And the state does have an interest and putting together standards and supporting them, and we have for decades, that there should be consequences if one individual inflicts pain on another. We just passed a bill in this legislature for a felony level fence for harm to a dog. Certainly if we can do that, we can pass legislation in the state of Minnesota to protect unborn children from such a painful death. 